Hello and welcome again to Ties and Tube Socks. Today we have our first female on the show. She's going to tell you a little bit about her style, the way she dresses, and things of that nature. So let's get to her. Hey, what's up? I'm Ashley Michelle. I'm a freshman at Spelman College from Queens, New York. I'm a psychology major, fashion minor. Um, I love thrift shopping, and I have hopes of being a stylist one day. Um, I'm an upcoming model as well, so you can check me out at www.facebook.com slash Ashley Night Show. What's up everybody? My name is Damon Scott. I'm a senior English major from Savannah, Georgia. Um, when I guess one interesting thing about me is that I do have an extreme interest in fashion. But one thing I want people to know is that it's not the man that makes the clothes, or it's not the clothes that make the man, but the man that makes the clothes. And definitely that, you know, dressing is fun, but it's the service that goes behind it. First of all, we want to thank our guests. And I'm so excited because we actually have our first female on the show. She has a different style. I don't know where it comes from, I can tell you. But she can. So where does your style come from? Um, I see my styles from um, all over. I've traveled a lot, the East Coast, outside the country. Um, I'm from New York, and um, I was raised in Atlanta. So it was kind of a mix of both of them. I'm really into fashion, so you know I'm always in Vogue, nylon. Um, I really like GQ, so I get a lot of masculine you know, influences and everything, so, kind of comes to my point. Dane is the GQ guy. <laughs> Look at how sharp he is. This guy has on corduroy shorts. I've never seen those before in my life. They're the dopest thing I've seen all day. So, tell us a little bit about this ensemble. Um, I just like threw this together, actually. I was late for class and I needed something to wear. Uh, but I want Ralph Lauren, uh, my shorts are Ralph Lauren, my uh, polo is Ralph Lauren. Uh, this cardigan is uh, vintage, so like I usually like always slip like a vintage piece in. Like I like labels, but a lot of times like my, my outfits cost like twenty dollars. I'm a big fan of like thrifting, so uh, I get most of my clothes from a thrift store. But definitely like I would describe my style as like preppy chic. Can I kind of get that from the south? So we like to golf and do things like that. So that's kind of influenced my style a lot. Wow, you say thrifty and you threw all this together. Mm -hmm. So basically you've just embarrassed a lot of people. They spend a lot of money. Yeah, like a lot of people spend money on clothes and it's, you don't have to. It takes hours for some of us to get dressed, me for one. And this guy threw this together. I mean, uh, you one of the finest people I've seen <laughs> all today, all today. Thank you, thank you. And you with the vest. Where did you, where did you even get this stuff from? Thrift stores as well. Uh, acid wash jeans, three bucks. Uh, wow. Goodwill for this, probably what, two bucks? Wow. Levi's vest in the other hand, maybe not two bucks. <laughs> but you know, I thrift for the most part. And um, I got a thing for sneakers, so. Okay, okay, I get that. A lot of people have it these days. So, both of you guys stand out. And if you ask me, you've created your own styles. But is there anybody in fashion that you guys actually look up to? Um, I definitely look up to. Um, yeah, there are a lot of people in fashion like, I look up to. Uh, of course, Ralph Lauren is a genius. I uh, love Alexander McQueen. You, um, but I think the biggest fashion influence that's on me is my mom. Like, I remember when I was one, she was like, you need to, like, actually, I went like four. She was like, you need to learn how to color coordinate. And I didn't know what that meant then. But um, now I do. And I think, like, that her style has definitely, like, influenced me. Uh, she will spend money on things, and then she won't. Like, she's definitely just like how I am as far as the way we dress and how we spend and thrifting and doing things like that. So I think even past designers, uh, my mother has the biggest influence on my style. Do you guys follow any trends at all? Because if I look at your styles right now, I think that this is just you. Like, nobody else looks like this, just you. Do you follow any trends? Um, yeah, I go with, uh, you know, some trends in Vogue and everything. I'm really, um, I guess, around West Coast style. 
fashion, by streetwear, by country exclusives, you know, Hell's Bells, Mary's Mob, things along those lines, like, like streetwear, so I guess I follow those trends. Yeah, I think, I think it's impossible not to be influenced by like fashion trends in this country, but I would definitely say I don't think I like constrain myself to one. Um, I will use a trend like, you know, for a long time on this campus, like Ralph Lauren was the thing to wear, so everyone was wearing it. But the thing is like putting your own personal twist to it, um, and so that's what I kind of do. And one other thing, I know a lot of people are scared of this, but the no socks thing. Did yeah, you that? no, like one of my best friends, I'll never forget, I was like a sock. Best friends wears no socks, and I'm like, okay, I kind of like how that looks. So I just start wearing no socks too, so it's comfortable. Yeah. And being a mismatched Hey, 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 hey.